Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create these with After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back. And in this video, I will show only two image textures. First, sky and second, texture buildings. So let's create new comp session and add the name 3D buildings and full HD sizes. 10 seconds, 25 frame rates, and click OK. And let's select this texture, drag and drop into the conversation, and press S, change scale, change quality full, and go to rectangle tool. Let's create mask like this. And click session tool, let's change name front. So in this time, select this front, let's control D for duplicate layer change name left again control d change name right again control d change name back so in this time let's go to window open animation comes as re anchor point mover also can use manually this icon pen behind and select this layer left let's click icon for move the anchor point to left Select layer right. Let's click this icon for move to anchor point to right. Okay, so in this time, select these all of them layers and click this checkbox for solid layer. So in this time, change view one and select this left. Let's press R, open rotation and change Y rotation minus 90. And select this layer right. Let's press R and go to Y rotation, change 90 and select layer back, go to here, let's turn on snapping and let's select the Z axis arrow and hold shift, move to back let's zoom in here, again let's select the Z axis and hold shift, snap here, ok here we go, we have full building 3D model so select these image layers, close rotation and change view active camera and in this time let's create new camera, right mouse new end camera and presses 50 millimeters and click OK. So we can control camera with these icons, hold this icon, we can use these tools for camera movements, also can press C on shortcut. Let's press C and change view for C3D model ok, very nice so in this time, let's change camera view a little bit like this and click C again, move to back and right now, let's create new solid layer add name ground and change color like this click OK, again click OK and move to behind of image layers, click 3D layer, press R and change rotation minus 90 and move to down and let's change scale, hold this icon and shift, change scale like this ok so in this time select these image layers and let's make it precomps right mouse and precompose, add name build one click ok so this is again 2d image and let's click this 3d icon again again this is 2d image for fix this problem let's go to conversation and click this icon ok and if you not see this part click toggle switch modes so in this time let's create lights right mouse new and light i will use two type lights first ambient light type and click OK and change view 1 select this ambient, let's double click for edit settings and change intensity like this click OK and let's create new light change light type spot and change color to white click OK and click OK again here so let's move to backlight and move to up select this cone, move to down 
and change view active camera. And let's double click for open settings, change fell off inverse secure clip it. And we can place settings here like this. So let's click OK and let's press C. Let's zoom here, change view. OK, so right now select this building conversation, Ctrl D for duplicate, move to Z axis. OK, let's change view one and move to back here. Back to again active camera. So let's see. OK, let's change camera view. Nice, and select is again conversation, Ctrl D and move to left here and move to back. Okay, very good, and select is conversation 1, Ctrl D and move to here and move to Z axis. Again, Ctrl D and move to back. And let's move to the axis like this. So in this time, select this sky and move to behind of conversations. And go to FX presets, search FX here saturation. Select saturation, use for sky. And click colorize checkbox. Change color to blue. And change to dark. Okay, so select this sky, let's press P and move to like this, create new person keyframe and go to 10 seconds, let's change quality quarter and let's move to left like this, let's see. Okay, pretty good and let's press C, change camera view. Okay, and let's play light settings for more realistic results. First, let's open ambient light and open color. Let's select this blue and change color like this. Click OK and change intensity a little bit like this. Click OK and open spotlight one. And we can play settings here. Let's change radius like this for more light and feather cone okay and cone angle and intensity and change color let's select here blue click ok again click ok here and select this layer ground let's move up And finally, let's create new adjustment layer. Add name Rain. And go to FX Presets, search FX CC Rain Fill. Let's use for adjustment layer. And we can play settings for rain animation. Let's see. Okay, we can change wind like this, and sizes and drops. Let's see. And finally, let's add camera animation. Select camera, let's right mouse, go to camera and create orbit null. And let's hold control, double click pen behind icon for move to anchor point center. Clicization tool, select null object, let's press P and create new passing keyframe. Go to 10 seconds and let's move to right like this. Let's see. Okay, and select this camera, let's hold shift, press R, open the rotation, and create X, Y rotations, go to last second, and let's change rotations a little bit like this. Okay, and this camera angle, let's change 3. Let's see. Okay, pretty good. So guys, thank you for watching my video, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video, and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.